Hey, 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 Libra singles, welcome back. I'm a Cancer Moon, Capricorn Rising, Libra Sun doing your reading today. These are just for Libra singles. So today we are going to travel down your story. Uh, this is definitely a verses from the last video. So that is com coming from a relationship. This is for Libras who are currently single, ready to mingle, ready to have a good time and a couple of cocktails. <laughs> So today we are going to do channeled messages for you and then we're going to do a tarot story for the Libra and singles on the channel. Again, welcome back. Thank you for the new subscribers who have joined the Libra family here on Libra Light. I appreciate it and I am enjoying your company. So Libra singles, we have channeled messages a lot that I have here in my phone. We're going to go down it, describe briefly what these feelings are. There's a lot of really intense feelings for Libra singles right now in the collective, so let's get it. We have, there's a magical dynamic. You could feel at times that this is something that you never felt before in a literal sense, like maybe people in the past have tried. They have definitely, definitely tried with you, Libra, but there is a magical dynamic that is going around your new talking relationship or your texting relationship with somebody at this time. There's a literal sense of fire you feel from this person. You legitimately feel this could even be a fire sign, yes. And there's interjecting moments of good similar vibrations. You both could be seeing similar things, same themes in your life, or even the same childhood. This person just gets you. This is a part of, the, of, of this particular person that understands Libra's ways, the way you joke, okay, the way you express yourself they just get it the first time, okay? The person um, maybe you met through a connection through a commonplace thread. So this could have been somebody at work or school, or this is in, invited by a friend of yours in your waking life. So this is a common meeting of a commonplace that you have. Um, you could also have similar life themes by way of growing up, Okay, they are showing you day by day how this could look and be in the end. So this person's really important to you right now, Libra single. Um, I feel like every day is a new day. You're getting to know them slowly. There's times of butterflies and there's also times that you're unsure. So to go down here and I have a couple of notes. So I'm gonna go off my notes today because there were very intense energies in the Libra collective today for singles. And I'm just gonna go off of my notes as I talk to you, okay? Uh, we have the wheel, we have the page of cups, this person could be younger than you. We also have the magician, so they could have manifested you in some way, Libra. I feel like maybe through this common friend that you have, uh, they could have possibly met you at in person as opposed to a dating website. Um, I feel like they sort of manifested you from somewhere, they've been dreaming of the type of person you are. Okay, um, heavy, heavy themes here on how they got to know you um in terms of feeling you out and they could have even seen you from afar before they met you so some term of manifestation with you libra you came to be in existence and then the talking sort of happened okay so you're feeling each other out basically eight of wands we also have fast communication they like to text you and they definitely like your gift of gab they love your balance your harmonious nature they also love your beauty or your handsomeness here if you're a guy. So definitely if this is a girl attracted to you right now, Libra male, uh, definitely going after you, has that fire sign sense to them. Uh, there's definitely heavy themes here of going after you, um, but they play it down, you know, they kind of play it safe. So everybody wants to call when there's a Libra video. <laughs> so uh, don't mind the busyness of the phone line today. That just means we're getting all of our signals and clarifications here through the airwaves, which we are air. Oh, that's the common thread, the phone calls, airwaves, something there. So definitely Libra, they have this like keen interest. They really like you. Okay, yeah, it's those types of feelings. So we're gonna go through the tarot story today. We're gonna do a three card split. We're also going to get bottom of the deck here as your challenge, lifting burdens before your singleness is taken away and you are taken. There are burdens here from the past single Libra. Again, um, this person that you're talking to could be younger. The Page of Cups is on the board. They could very well be like somebody who is intimidated by you. There's heavy 
energy of intimidation. They really, really respect you uh, without knowing all the details. So um, page of cups, and we also have burdens that might be hindering you from um, also going after them fully. This could be burdens just that you have in your life with your scheduling. Um, and I think it really hurts you because you want to be able to give more. Okay, Libra. But you're still continuing to talk to them, which is good. Um, let's get the tarot story for what's going on in this new love. Okay. This is an exclusive. I don't think anybody's kind of going into the new love on any sort of channel right now. Um, let's see what's going on here today. Libra, sun, moon, rising for Libra. Sun, moon, rising for the new love. Thank you, spirit. That one jumped. I caught it. Yeah, seven of cups. This came out in the previous reading. This is like confusion over what to do next. This is sort of like playing your next chess move with this new person. I do think that the new love is really extremely sweet, Libra, but I think that you have other options. I think there's many people on the board for Libra, um, all team Libra. But I think too, you are being really concise how you choose your next partner. They, they are gonna have a different identity from what you're used to. Okay, we'll take those two. Libra, new love. Libra, new love. Libra, new love. Thank you, Spirit. We'll take that one, and we'll take bottom of the deck. Um, we already had contentment before, but the King of Cups is something that I want to discuss with you because I do feel, truthfully, this is in the air. I think you're in your emotions about how to feel with this new person. It's been a really long time, Libra, since you let yourself go and really be there. Um, I do think, though, you're taking into account how this is making you feel right now. If this person makes you feel beautiful, radiant, they're speaking to you in a poetic fashion, you are loving that. But you're also in your emotions. This could definitely be about the past person. This could be about letting go. And this could be about what the new chapter could hold for you. And I think it means a lot to you because you want to do it right this time. Um, we also have more of a tarot story here. We've got the tower. We have the page of wands. I think your challenge is being the page of wands at this time, being able to let go of the past. I think with Librans too, we're so nostalgic and the balance is making sure we close out chapters so we could progress. I think you trying to be excited about this new love is your challenge card for today. I think you have high hopes. Um, there's a song from, I can't, it's a, like a really new song. In the lyric, it says, I have high, high hopes for a living or something like that. Uh, very, very poised song. Great, great artist. Um, I'll put that in the description box. I think you do have these really sweet high hopes, but you're almost afraid to put your foot in the water. Okay. Um, maybe perhaps this week you could have more of a one-on-one -on -one with this person and really feel it out. That is a good test to see if this person is meant for you and fits in your life and understands your life and your schedule and everything like that. We have the tower here. Um, I believe the tower was so you could form a better foundation. They are about faulty foundations, the tower. The tower happens because something in your life is not naturally implemented to be there. So I think the tower that came in for you, Libra, I feel this is recent past, but very, very recent. I think that the tower was to show you that you've got to rebuild. It's sort of like when a, you know, a building collapses or there's been a natural disaster. There's a cleanup and then it's a whole new structure. That's exactly what needs to happen to you at this time, Libra. I think a lot of people don't tell you that maybe because they feel you're too soft and you can't hear it. I do think that it is sort of a clean up, rebuild the structure type of deal and then paint it a brand new color, okay? So as opposed to where it was a gray building before it now has to go up as a blue building. Something like that. I get that whole energy, that whole esque and vibe today. We also have the two of cups. This is confirming you're gonna come together in a higher commitment. This is them professing that commitment to you, whether they make you boyfriend or girlfriend in the near or distant future. This is what they want with you. This is the end game, Libra, singles. And I do think that they care. So right now they could be extra caring and nurturing. This could possibly be a water sign that's coming into your life, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. That's all I have for you today, Libra singles. We will expand on this if this content is something that you enjoy again. I wish you the best with all of this. Libra Singles, thank you for watching.